day 54 of my 90 day challenge Anthony Chan Smith here and today's focus has really been on a couple of things a couple of really nice thing ha uh, things happened today so first this morning I had a chat with my friend lovely friend Khan and uh, we have we were just having a brainstorming and a creativity session which is really cool over Google Hangout and uh, talking about a concept that we have for a video, a little short film, I guess, that we would like to do together. So uh, that was really fun, and just showed or revealed how much I enjoy that creative, the creation process and the brainstorming process with someone who's really creative like her. So that's really cool. So look out for that. Uh, our next action really is to uh, take the concept and then turn it into a workable script now it, this whole process is new to me because I've never written a script before or done anything like this I mean the closest thing that uh, comes to it is I performed in the school musical in the, in the 10th grade um, but you know I was the actor in that and that's all even not even that I was a uh, supporting cast member in that and just had to learn my lines but now it's actually starting from scratch, like the whole concept and the idea uh, and putting that all together and then finding a team, the videographer and, every, and the, uh, the cast members to, to join us on this project. So I'm actually looking for someone who can be the videographer and editor to edit the piece. So that's going to be really interesting. Uh, my regular guy is actually going away, he's going overseas. So uh, he's not going to be available. So if you are watching this and you know someone who wants to do some creative work, um, we're all just doing it. I mean, the intent is really just to have fun and provide great ent entertaining stories for people on YouTube. Um, it's not a money-making exercise, so we're not doing it for that so much. Um, but it's really just to express our creativity and uh, and have fun together. So that's really really exciting for me and uh, the other thing that came up during the coaching session with one of my clients today was really how do you define success and how do you redefine success because you know we can get so caught up easily caught up on society's views or other people's uh, definitions of success and that causes you know it can cause disappointment it can cause uh, regret and just if we're always trying to live up to someone else's expectations and, and not our own and not you know defining success for ourselves then you know we may never get there and, and it's almost like a uh, you know a, a race that you can never win and isn't it better that you can choose which race you want to be in and actually, you know, or choose the game you want to play? Is that the game you want to play? One that was, or makes you feel bad and, um, you know, you end up beating it up on yourself and uh, really not enjoying life? You know, is that the kind of life you want to have? Or do you want to choose to have a different game? One where success is determined and defined on the inside and, and one that comes from you know um, being present enjoying the moment having a goal having a, f a plan for the future I mean that's important still um, and remembering the past and remembering how far we've come you know let me just get off the bike here as we go up this hill but uh, so that's it was a good reminder of that for me it was kind of like yeah where am I in my life and it's we're hitting the end of the year now and time to start for me to go through my uh, cycle or uh, my reflection period and I go through and look at okay all the things that I've achieved and accomplished more importantly who I've become and then set the vision for 2014 uh, so the other really cool things that's happened is I've been speaking to uh, some friends and asking okay I'm turning 35 this year or next year on January 1 so I want to celebrate New Year's Eve with some really good friends and you know and I really don't like the idea of 
going into the city and surrounding myself with thousands of drunken people um, you know that's not really appealing to me it was maybe 15 years ago but now it's more about okay what I why not enjoy that time with really good friends people who I relate to who I'm connected to and then doing something really special so we've come up with the idea of you know, creating our vision boards on that night and really on New Year's Eve and just watching the fireworks together so there may be still you know still be a crowd but it's a different um, intention behind it and so that's kind of where it's heading and I'm really looking forward to that so it's gonna be the first time I ever run a vision board session so that's new to me too so all right so just I wanted to leave this message uh, asking you what is your definition of success how do you measure that and you know are you creating are you playing a game where you can win uh, consistently and and enjoy the process or are you playing a game which is someone else's really uh, and you know and just getting disappointed and, and hating yourself for it so uh, whatever it is for you I'd love to hear about it post a comment below um, subscribe to my videos because some more cool stuff's coming up and uh, let me know yeah if you've been watching these videos I'd love to hear what you think of them because you know it's been well it's 50 53 days already so uh, it's been really a, an interesting journey for me so I'm glad that you're you're part of it so thank you very much and I'll talk to you tomorrow see ya